everybody. It is Monday, April 19th, 2021, and we're going to be doing a card of the day of focus of intention as directed by spirit, universe, energy, whatever it is you call to choose on today. It is Miracle Monday, Manifestation Monday, Make Shit Happen Monday, My Ferifunga Mia Gunda Monday, My Ferifunga Elegua, My Ferifunga Eshu, My Ferifunga Tol Mi Orishas Monday. It's a great day to be fucking alive, so I am grateful to be here with you another day. First and foremost, let's get some announcements out of the way. The Almighty Pineapple LLC is trademarked, copyright, and registered with several different classifications with the United States government. Every duplication of my content without my permission is up to the legal recourse guided by my lawyer and her badass motherfucking team. With that being said, this Saturday, April 24th, 2021 at 12 p.m. Eastern Standard Time, we are having our pre-order scheduled sale for our module envelopes and our pendants. The Transformation Pendant, the Lots of Love Pendant, and the Double A Pendant. I have an explanation and description on my post on Instagram at readings by vida i also have igtv episodes explaining what they do and my own personal testimonials of what the pendants and the mojo envelopes has done for me in the last several years i will never sell you anything that i have not personally used or my family has used in any way shape or form that is not what i'm about i'm not going to push something onto you that i have never worked with that i don't know nothing about so there you go first and foremost but also i haven't put it up on the website yet Next Monday, April 26, 2021 at 8 p.m. Eastern Standard Time is the next community ritual. It will be $11.11 and I'll put the breakdown up shortly and I'll announce that again on Instagram at Readings by Vida as well. With that being said, I also want to tell you guys about my services. I only have about five days left of openings for any services in the month of May at this time so with that being said if you're interested in working with me please follow your intuition working with any spiritual advisor even if that means you do not work with me your intuition will guide you to who what when where and how to work with those spiritual advisors and practitioners follow your intuition go to the almighty pineapple.com go to the book now virtual sessions page and you can schedule your own appointment at that time unfortunately all in-person sessions that are held in brooklyn new york have been sold out for april and may at this time when i get june july and august dates i will definitely put them up and announce them as well at readings by Vida on Instagram and on the Almighty Pineapple LLC page on Instagram as well. Now, with that being said, let's get to the card of the day. This is a focus of intention for the next 24 to 40 hours. As I said before, this is not a reading. A reading is an intimate discussion between you and a spiritual advisor of your choice, hopefully led by your intuition. This is, as I always say, your intuition is your superpower. Everyone's born intuitive. Not everyone listens to their intuition. Number one, we have the Field of Dreams card. And then we have the Unexpected Visitors card. So, with that being said... Field of Dreams, 21 Upright, and Unexpected Visitors Upright. Let's see. Field of Dreams. Do, 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 Field of Dreams. Your thoughts, feelings, and beliefs are always engaging the vast field of your pure potential. This is a perfect time to harness the field of vast potential not yet realized in your life. Great abundance is yours if you're willing to do the work alongside the gentle gardener. Be clear about your thoughts, feelings, and beliefs. Concentrate on your best life regardless of the temporary outer conditions imposed on you by the greater world, which has its own story to tell. You have a basket full of seeds that are quite powerful, for your talents are divinely inspired, will indeed lead to a great harvest to be shared with others. You will reap what you've sown, dream big, dream beautiful, take action, and tend to the garden of your life and experience the extraordinary. Basically, don't let anybody else dampen your fucking dreams. Your dreams have no expiration dates or deadlines. Do not let anybody else douse your dreams, water, like try to water your dreams. Those are your visions, your blueprints, your understandings, your knowingness, your supreme authority, your sovereignty. You walk into your space. If nobody else believes it, they don't have to believe it, but they do have to respect that you have a dream and you're going to accomplish your your dream so follow it plant those seeds and be patient because even in nature overnight you plant a seed it doesn't burst out overnight it literally takes time to break through the soil and then bud and bloom so be patient with your dreams and then after the field of dreams we have the unexpected visitors pay um card excuse me and let's see what this has to say 40 it's funny because Field of Dreams is 21, Unexpected Visitors is 41. So if you expect the unexpected, you'll prepare for miracles. Detours, surprises, and paradigm shifts. Expect the unexpected. No matter how detailed your plans are and how clear you believe the road ahead to be, there are always times when the best plans are waylaid by unforeseen circumstances. I put up a post yesterday, matter of fact, last night on a Sunday on my Instagram page, at readings by vida stating if you knew what was coming would you actually go through it like the universe your ego stop expecting not knowing sometimes is the answer and this is confirmation of the unexpected visitors card 
At first, detours may seem inconvenient, but a surprise turn of events signal the adventure of life is beginning to get interesting. No one can plan for synchronicity, for fate and destiny to meet except spirit, universe, energy, whatever you call it. Who knows what your life can com can't comprehend for now. Life is full of surprises, so stay on your toes and enjoy this exciting new adventure you weren't expecting. There is a plan for your life that may not match up with your agenda, and your agenda is usually what your want is, and your want is your ego, and your ego is human. And what do I tell you guys all the time? What you want is human, but what you need is divine. And sometimes your needs are way bigger than you want, and if you ended up getting what you wanted, Think about it. some of those relationships you swear you wanted. Oh my God, I love you. I want to be with you. I don't know why this is happening. Think about it now. If you look back at it, do you really think that that's what you really wanted? At the moment, it's what you wanted, but now I need you to pull back. Is it what you needed? So they're saying plant those seeds. Don't let anybody dampen your dreams and expect the unexpected because your dreams will definitely give you what you need if you are in alignment with yourself, if you're honest, if you're authentic, if you're consistent with your spiritual or your energetic health, if you're moving through things, if you're not pulling yourself back, if you're trusting yourself and having faith in yourself because faith is the energy that's going to catapult you to the next level. And yes, times can be hard. And yes, they can be unexpected and it may be difficult or inconvenient or uncomfortable. But sometimes being uncomfortable is the best bet so you can work through it because everything you desire is on the other side of that fear. I hope I helped. I hope I put some things in perspective. I hope I made you feel better. Thank you for liking, commenting, subscribing to this channel. Thank you for fucking with me. And thank you so much for all your support. Please share this video with someone who you feel you're going to resonate with. And I will truly Send you all the love and prayers. You guys are all my prayers always, every day. My community is everything to me. Thank you for my YouTube family, for my Instagram family, for my Twitter family. I love y'all so much. See y'all later.